All right, all right, all right, everybody. I just got out of the Chucho Valdez concert with the Frost School of Music Studio Jazz Band. And, um, one, sorry that it's fucking dark and there's going to be traffic around me. And anyways, it was fucking awesome. There's really not much I have else to say. We started and they just set up. Well, actually, it was our set first. Get on stage, band hits. And then the solo section starts. I'm the third soloist. First two soloists sound great. Then it's JD time. And, um, you know, I laid, I laid it down, which is... It felt awesome because, you know, big band... It's, it's a really easy thing to, like, to mess up. You know, if you miss your moment, if you're thinking too much, it's just gone. But I, I just let myself slip in that zone of the perfect balance of, like, premeditated and spontaneous. And I just had a great solo. I really did. Over the bridge of the tune, I played a Love Supreme, like, around the circle of force. That shit was fire. I... <laughs> It's so interesting to hear myself say that about my own playing, but sometimes you just got to give yourself credit where credit is due, I guess. And I felt great about the solo, and the, the crowd loved it. After our set, we got a standing ovation. And, yeah. It felt good, because, you know, the trombone... The trombone is the trombone for me. I mean, I've talked about it before with you guys. I'm kind of at ends with it, but... At the end of the day... Thank you so much. At the end of the day, you know, this is my, this is really my second voice, the trombone. And I do still have love in my heart for it. I really do. Um, gosh, I have no clue where the heck I parked. Um, I think, oh, thank you so much. I, uh, I appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for coming. Uh, probably. His I saw Scott. Died. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Uh, yeah, I think he's still in the dressing room right now. Your I got out kind of early. You're, you're <laughs> yes, I'm Jaden. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Scott's great. Uh, we're so happy to have him in the band. Well, I'm glad he loves he working with you guys. He's Which year are you in? I'm a junior, a third year. Um, so yeah, it was. I, I'm so grateful. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm so grateful to have been able to be a part of something like this. <laughs> Uh, okay, yeah. Take care, guys. Bye-bye. Um, okay, that happened. They said cross. Okay, I'm crossing. Jeez, this is like the most chaotic vlog I've ever recorded. Anyways, so yeah, that happened. It was cool. Chucho, the, the concert itself was freaking phenomenal. Chucho played on stage. I started... F he brought me to tears, you know? He... It was just watching a genius at work. And it was it was a spectacle. You love to see it. Afterwards, we played our whole set. This shit was spiritual. I mean, it literally was, though. It was like about the creation of the world. It was like the creator suite. Aludamare. It's like this god of, like, the creation god of this religion, the Yoruba religion. And... You know, we've been rehearsing this music for months and it finally came to fruition and it just feels great. And, you know, I had my moment with the trombone, like I mentioned earlier, which is, you know, I got to remember my roots. It is my voice and I'm, I'm pretty good, you know, I'm not insane, but my musicianship shines. I, I'm actually grateful that I play trombone. Because even though it's a fucking piece of shit instrument, it forces you to, like, really show who you are. It forces you to show your musicianship. There's no, there's no hiding behind the trombone. You can hide behind the guitar. You can hide behind the piano. You can, behi you can hide behind the saxophone. Trumpet, not as much. Trumpet, you can't really hide. But especially trombone. There's, there's nowhere to hide. You just have to bare your soul. And I believe that was accomplished tonight. I really do. And, you know, my section is full of great guys. It was just overall a great experience. 
And now I'm off to party. It's my friend's 21st birthday tonight. We have this like frat themed party going on at the house. And oh gosh, I have to get up early tomorrow, but maybe for the one time I'll just get really drunk. Who knows? I'm at, you know, I'm always conflicted about something. But um, guess we'll see what happens. I am gonna go to the party gonna get pretty wasted maybe there'll be a girl there gosh i don't i don't even know what i want on one hand i'm horny because you know i'm still on the nofap which is going great by the way i feel like myself again but on the other hand i don't really want to so there's two hands that want different things anyways that's it for now bye guys